What's going on everyone? I have decided that this week I'm going to be doing a week in my life uh, while my husband's at basic. So here we go. <laughs> All right, so um, I've already got my morning started. I've taken a shower. I've taken care of the animals. Um, this can be a different week than normal because I'm on spring break at school. So I figured this would be a good week to just kind of do a normal week. Um, but normally I'd be at school right now. Um, I'm actually getting ready to leave for work. Um, my dog is wanting to go outside. So here he is. She's like, I want to go outside. You're not allowed to go to work. So... That's what she's doing. I got the bunnies outside and she's just like, I want to go outside too. But not today. We'll get to go out later. Even go to the dog park this week. So I'm going to grab my stuff and get headed out on the road and I'll check in a little bit later. All right, I just got to work. It is a 40 minute drive from my house to my main job um that's pretty much it it was a, well, it was a nice drive this way the sun's out the sky is clear i need to drink my coffee so it's a really like nice drive just because of that and you're driving through the countryside so it's pretty relaxing a great way to kind of like prepare yourself wake up before the work day starts so I'm gonna head in and get clocked in and I'm not doing my usual job today I'm filling in as the pool manager um, since a lot of people are out of town and normally I oversee lifeguards and all that stuff so <sighs> it'll be a day but my day's shorter than normal so I'm working 10 30 to 4 versus my usual like 8 45 to 6 or 5 or whatever I'm working that day so this is going to be a nice change and I'm excited to kind of have a night with my animals and getting some stuff done so I will check in later bye hey everybody what's going on um it's about 4 30 right now I'm on the way home um, I'm over halfway home right now so this is my favorite part of my drive probably the favorite part of my day a because I'm going home but B because I love this drive um, I grew up about five minutes from my current job and then I married my husband and had to move away and I never had to commute and I've been doing it for over a year now and I absolutely love it and I think it's mostly just because my drive every day is so relaxing I'm driving through farmland right now there's cows uh, there's a beautiful view of the state line um, the river valley it's so pretty I'm hoping that I can find like a little mount for my phone and then gonna do like a little view of my drive one day um anyway so the rest of my day I got off earlier than I normally do during the week so I'm kind of excited about that I'm gonna go home and enjoy the weather a little bit it's 54 here today which it's been like 30 and below for the past like month so it's really nice out. I'm gonna get some yard work done, let the dog play. Um, I might get her to the dog park sometime this week. I don't know if it's gonna happen tonight. Uh, I'm gonna run to Walmart before I go home. And yeah, I need to get a shovel. I have a garden that I do in the summertime, so I need to start getting the dirt stirred up a little bit so I need a shovel my husband didn't have one I need to like write to him and be like you're a terrible farmer why do you not have a shovel um he I know his shovel is with his work van which his work van's with his boss right now for obvious reasons but yeah so 
I'm going to continue my drive. I'm about, I don't know, 10, 15 minutes from Walmart. Then I will check in for my almost favorite and sometimes not favorite part of the day where I check the mail. So I will see you then. I got, I'm so happy I got two letters today. It's always so exciting. So my mom got a letter today, so I was expecting to get one more than usual. You know, you kind of get your hopes up. Those that are going through the same thing as me or have been through the same thing or about to, just so you know, <laughs> you may not try to only look forward to the letters, but sometimes that's the best part of the day. So I'm super excited. I'm gonna go read my letters and then I'm going to uh, do some of my other chores that I was gonna look and doing. Um, Walmart, I got a shovel and I got a whole bunch of seeds. It's always really, really, really hard to rein myself in when I'm at Walmart. So I'm like, ooh, I want this and I want this one with this, especially with all the decorations out and there's some really cute ones out right now. So I'm gonna go read my letters and I'll check in with you guys soon. Bye. Hey everyone. Kind of just winding down. I'm making dinner now. Um, just got the dishes done. Making some uh, roast and green beans and mac and cheese. Kind of a simple, simple-ish dinner. Um, didn't pick up any vegetables today, so I'm kind of like, I should have did that when I was at Walmart. But I'm um, just kind of winding down. I'm gonna make my dinner, and then my nightly routine. I watch one of the movies from my list. So I finished off the C movies. Sorry, the movie TV's loud. The uh, credits or not credits, the previews are playing. Um, so I finished all my C movies and now I'm on to my D movies and I'm starting, I kind of just pull some random ones out. So depending on what I want to watch, and I really want to watch Dear John for obvious reasons. So I'm going to watch my movie, eat my dinner and work on my letters to my husband. So I'll probably write him quite a long one tonight. I usually write about two to three pages of a legal pad. Um, just cause I always have a lot to say, but I also like responding to his letters. So I tell him about my day and then I uh, respond to his letters and kind of just things that he's talking about. Just so it feels like we're actually having a conversation. Um, so that will be about it for tonight. I will probably see or I will see you tomorrow um so I'll see you in the morning good morning everyone I am on my way to work um I had a kind of a late start this morning I was really really tired last night at these because I shoveled my garden and I was just really, really tired and kind of achy when I woke up this morning. And so it took me forever to get out of bed. And it does not help. It is raining today. And it's super gloomy. It's kind of the sleep weather that I really just don't want to get up today. So I am on my way. I fed all my animals. My dog ran around the yard and got everybody muddy. I think the back of my legs aren't muddy because of her. Um, I have boots that I wear out into the yard, but sometimes it just splashes everywhere. So I did that. I packed my lunch, made my coffee, and just ate my Pop Tarts because breakfast of champions. Um, and then I got my letter to my husband out into the mail and that was my morning so uh, Tuesdays are usually one of my like long days just because I have a lot of back and forth going on um, when I have school I work
work first thing in the morning, usually from 8.45 to like 1.30. And then I go to school for my, my studio class, which is um, a singing class, uh, a part of my private voice lessons. And we all just kind of sing in front of each other. And then I go back to work. Um, usually I'll have swim lessons I have to oversee from four to like six-ish, which I have those tonight, but I don't have school, so it's gonna be a straight day. Straight through kind of day. And then after swim lessons, I usually go hang out with my parents for a little bit. And um, sometimes I make me dinner. Great dinner is always great. Um, I usually hang out there for about an hour and then I head to where I volunteer at. Um, I usually have to be there by 7.30 for, um, ooh, it's getting hot in here. <laughs> um, I usually get there about, so, or I have to be there at 7.30. What I do, I volunteer at a therapeutic horseback riding center. Um, uh, it's the, the class I help with is adults and they have different disabilities and they all ride and we assist them. So it's pretty rewarding. Um, love doing that and that's usually like the end of my night. So it makes my Tuesday for a really long day because I usually don't get done there until like 8.30. And then it takes me an hour to get home from there because it's completely in the opposite direction of my house. But that's usually my Tuesday. So it's a long day. So it will change one day because that was originally my schedule for last semester when I had um, an evening class or late afternoon class, I guess, late afternoon to evening class on Tuesdays and I would just go to the barn afterwards. Well, now I don't have anything and it kind of stinks. Um, I'll have to figure out something in the future, but my husband might also uh, train to go out there with me, so that may be something that we can do together. Anyway, so that's gonna be my day. So I'll probably jump in update y'all here and there of course for all you it's just gonna be like one long continuous video so happy tuesday it's rainy and gloomy it matches the mood of the day so but hopefully it'll still be a good day and maybe i'll have a letter waiting for me when i get home but it's one of those days i don't want to get my hopes up i rarely get letters two days in a row but maybe i'll get lucky maybe my husband's writing me a lot because you know, he definitely expressed like how much he missed me he also expressed that they told him today that when they graduate they're not allowed to move which I we already both knew until we get there and he says you better hurry up and get down there as fast as you can it's like oh my gosh I was like now I'm just gonna walk as slow as I can but we all know that's not possible <laughs> so y'all have a wonderful day and I will check in with y'all later so bye hey everybody well, I'm just finally getting a chance to check in. It's about seven o'clock at night. I'm getting ready to go volunteer. Actually, I'm here right now. I'm just I'm a little early, so I don't want to head in too early. I just kind of need a moment to de decompress. Excuse me. Um, so today was a really fast day. Actually, my um job went quickly today. Um, I got a lot done. Actually, I feel like I didn't get very much done, but it was the first day of swim lessons, so I got to supervise that. Training another supervisor to kind of help me out for when I need to um, go on vacation and stuff. And just in case my other boss cannot fill in. So, I did that. It looks like it's getting to ready to rain again. Wish I could flip flop this camera so you can look, but um, yeah, it's actually no. I can just flop it like this. Look at the sky; it's so 
dark and it was sunny earlier and I got to enjoy about five seconds of it when I walked into my parents house um I had a little meal-ish when I was there and um yeah oh, so now I'm going here I'll be here for about an hour and then I get a long drive home since I drove further south from my parents house and I live way north so that's going to be fun. I'm super tired and just ready to go home. Tuesday is always just a really, really, really long day, even without school. But uh, I know there was going to be more I talked about. And now that I'm on camera, my brain's just kind of gone flat. So I'm going to go into the barn now. So, I will check in probably when I get home because I think it will be dark by the time I get up and you won't be able to see me. So, I will talk at you when I get home. And... Hey everyone, I'm home. I'm trying to get my heat turned back on because it's rainy outside and I'm freezing. <laughs> I got home and there we go. I got home just a minute ago, went out and got in the mail, and went and let my dog outside. Excuse this mess over here. My husband's stuff that he left and my mess. So, um, <laughs> getting the heat turned on, and now I'm getting ready to make myself a snack because I kind of ate at my parents' house earlier and watching a movie and that's about it i like wandering when i'm talking <laughs> i do that on the phone too so um and yeah that kind of wraps up my day today it's kind of a boring day since i just worked i'm not sure how excited tomorrow is gonna be either but that's just my life usually. But I'm on to put my marker down for the day. And I'll show you all this in just a minute. But I take these gold stars. I'm gonna drop them on the floor. Take these gold stars and I put them on my calendar every day. Last night I was so tired that I started putting a star on every day, just not even thinking about it. And I was super tired, I was like, no, so I had to like take them off because I'm like, this is my part of my day. So I'm gonna share this moment with you. So here's my calendar for in March and I'm just gonna put this on the 19th because we're done. So we've come a long way. So there's all of February. I love them because I have like little quotes on them. And then, I don't know, they make me pretty excited. And then there's when I'll see my husband again. So, but we got a long ways to go before he's home. So, I have all of that. And there's the last month. Is right there so no, I'm not even looking at it but my last month it seems so far away but we're getting there it's going by fast I mean one month went by fast or kind of slow and month two is going a lot faster and so I mean I only have a month left so I'm pretty excited about that so I'm going to go ahead and get ready to go to bed and I will talk to you all tomorrow morning. Bye.